And we are back. Thanks for staying with us. With me in the kitchen this morning, making his debut, of course, on the show is Chef T Square. Hi, Titi. How are you doing this morning? I'm very good. Oh, we have two morning. Titis on the show. Interesting. <laughs> okay. Well, this morning, T Square will be making um, basted fries with asun. Sounds yummy. Trust me, guys. Something just went off in my head, right? <laughs> Run through the ingredients for us, would you? Uh, actually, we have um, so many ingredients that can make up this stuff. Okay. This is goat meat. We have onions. We have yam. We have uh, pepper. And we have uh, ready-made spice. Okay. Ready-made spice by T-square spice. You want to tell us what's in that yeah. ready-made spice again? Mm. It's What's just the secret ingredients? Uh, mm, there's not a secret about it. It's just a spice okay. uh, that someone can easily get anyway. And tell us and, now so that we uh, can also, you know, concoct our own, you know, put it together. No worry, if you want it, you can contact me. Ah, uh -huh, you see? You see? <laughs> so yeah, contact T contact, um, Square. And I have Sisney Cube here. Okay. So. And the vegetable oil. And the vegetable oil. Great. So you say bested fries. I'm not exactly sure. How does it look? What does it entail? What goes into it? Yeah, it's just a coated fries. Coated with? What are we coating it with? Pepper. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. So instead of having sauce beside it, mm. you can actually okay. have... Okay. So take us through the process. Um, let's try to visualize what it's going to look like, right? So once we're done, you know, slicing our, on our yam, okay. what do we do? You rinse it. After rinsing it, okay. then... You can you 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 coat it with your uh, spice, okay. which is the T-square spice. Oh, we are coating spice. it with the yes. T-square spice yes. and what else? So that's all. Okay, I, you know when and you said coat it, I thought you meant you are going to coat it with the pepper, like no, no, the no. blended pepper. The pepper is for the asun. For the asun, great. The so what are we doing the with the pepper and the onions? So the pepper and the onions is for asun. Yeah, what are we doing with the pepper and the onions? Are we so slicing? We, are no, we no, we're blending? going to we are going to grate it. Great, yeah, great. Just, just a blend. Oh, okay, just a rough yeah, blend rough of blend. it, and then we're going to yeah. use it for the asun. Has this soup been asun been already? This goat's meat. Sorry. Yeah, this I'm is call it asu. Mm -hmm. goat's meat. Yeah, it's a uh, it's a roasted goat's meat. Oh, We've roasted. roasted it already. Mm, nice. Went through a lot of work. Looks like it looks like good goat's meat. If you're just joining us with me in the kitchen this morning, is T Square, and he's making basted fries, basted fries with Asun special, yes. And of course, if you're wondering what is basted, he's just going to be slicing up the yams and in chunks and then um, rolling it in his um, spice, his special T-square spice, and frying it up, right? Yeah. Great. Um, so let's get to work. You have your pans and your pots at yep. your disposal. So just go ahead, grab them, and then let's get cooking. There's a lot of work to be done here. We still have to blend our... We still have to blend our pepper, um, I'm still sh I, and then our onions as well, and then use it for our good meat. And then, yes, a lot of work gets to be done. This is what's going to get on it very soon. So, yes, people, I have something very, very special to tell you. Yes. So, do we count down or do I get the drums rolling? Yes. Valentine's Day is upon us. Yeah, Do you have a Valentine's? Do you have anyone you're spending Valentine's Day? I'm married. I have one. So yeah. <laughs> yeah. So <laughs> lucky him. He also gets to be a part of what we have planned for you guys this Valentine's season. You want me to break it to them, Mazino? Should I tell them? Should I tell them? Yeah, go ahead, please. All right, great. So this Valentine's Day, people, we have something special for you. Couples, couples, oh, couple, oh, we are not encouraging. <laughs> yes. For couples, people, we have great, we have something specially planned for you. We have, we are giving you a date, a special date at a very fancy restaurant. Yes, you're still tuned in to Wake Up Nigeria. And yes, with me in the kitchen this morning is Chef T Square. Hello, hello, hello. Hi, hi, hi. Look at that good smooth. All right, guys, so let me just let you in on what it is we are making on the show this morning. Well, he is, I'm just here standing pretty as always. He'll be making basted fries with asun, spicy asun. So, um, T-square, run through the ingredients for, our, for the recipe this morning. 
Oh, okay. This is blended pepper. Okay. And this is a uh, yam, yam, peeled one. And mm. this is a uh, ready-made spice. Mm, the tea square have, special spice. So we have onions. Okay. And the goat meat. This is vegetable oil. And our seasoning cubes is. And our well. seasoning cube. Yeah. So what are we doing with our goat meat? I see that you're heating it up. That goat meat looks nice. Yeah. This is uh, for her soon. Yeah, I know. What yeah, are you doing? Actually, I'm going to pour pepper now. Oh, you're going to pour the yes, pepper I'm in it? Yes, I'm going to pour the pepper now. Okay, Just so go ahead. Bit. Let's do that. All right. Are you pouring all that pepper in no, there? No, 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 no. Okay. okay. Don't be scared. Oh, that looks good. So we have already steamed the goat's meat, right? Yes. And smoked. You said something about smoke. Yes. Must every assume be smoked? Yes, ma'am. Or oh, is that what gives it that taste? That's exactly what uh -huh. gives the taste. Great. Oh, that looks good already. I've not even had it in my mouth yet. How do you smoke it, though? Uh, actually, it's, uh, we smoke it with charcoal, you know. We prepare a charcoal and with, on a grill. So oh, really? It, after you've killed your goat, you know, mm. you debone it. Mm. You can see that there's no yeah, sign there's no of bone, bone. Yeah. So you debone it and okay. you you smoke it. Okay. So you basically put it on a grill yes. at home and then yes. you just leave it there. That's after you've steamed or no, 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 right no, no. after you after just you've, washed after it. After you've washed it, after okay. you've um, do the necessary things yeah, about and just the, put it in and you just... put it on the grill. So. Okay. Okay. Seems like a lot of work because it's going to take like quite a long time, yes. right? You can say that again. Aha! Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Fantastic. So it looks like um, you, I mean, Asu must be your special. Uh, well, you can say that, but I'm, I'm all in all. Okay, so tell me, food. how long have you been, you know, in the cooking space, you know, cooking and catering to people? Well, I started early. I started okay. early. I think I started as far back as uh, 2002. Whoa. So, I, yeah. 2002, so, how has it been? It has not been easy. Oh, my, uh, world. Not been easy. oh my world. But then again, 2002, there are not so many male chefs. Do you sort of, like, did that affect you somewhat? Like, oh, oh, there are not a lot of men in this field. How am I going to survive? How am I going to thrive? How am I going to cope? Are people going to be able to, how would, do, how would people respond uh, to me? Actually, that time, so many things involved. We are just mm. doing it based on passion. We ah. are not doing it for profit. Oh, okay. Then and there is no social media like the way it is mm. now where we to can promote. push it, push it mm. the way it is now. Mm. But now you have everything. To the glory, I don't have so. everything, but we uh, I mean you yeah. I mean the tools that you need to promote of your course, business. I course. mean you have this show which okay. you're leveraging on to promote your business, your Tiger's brand. Case. I mean you also have social media. Yeah. I mean you have like there's so many tools to work with, right? Yeah. Great. Let's see how that assume mm. is going. Mm, it's looking really good. Are we, are we going to add more pepper? I, for, I don't know. You know, as soon now, it's something you need to understand your customer. Mm. There are some people who, who love like, pepper. Oh, yeah. They are pepper-oriented yeah. people. Yeah. And there are some people that doesn't like pepper at all. Mm -hmm. So you need to understand. But for people that with this, Yes, I don't know. If they, so you're uh, trying so to you know, tread ca with caution. Got it. Got it. All right, people. If you're just tuning in and you're wondering what's going on in the kitchen today, that looks good. Well, Chef T-Square is making basted fries with Asun spice. <laughs> that spice is spicy, right? It's giving spicy vibes all around. And of course, we're going to be working with our. What are you about to do? This is seasoning. Okay, so you want to add seasoning yeah. cubes to yes. that? Ooh, okay. Give it that extra flavor that it needs. Really nice, really nice. So, at what? Where do we begin to use our onions? When it's about, um, when you are about to remove it from. Uh huh. So you just, you know, um, slice, slice it in, it. give it that little bit of flavor, yeah. not too much, not just too much. you know, somewhere in between. And it makes it look. Ah. Chef T Square is obviously a professional. Like, I mean, he's been doing this for donkey years and <laughs> really good at it. That looks good. Oh, I see what the seasoning cube did to it. It also gave it an extra color. Yeah. Nice. 
And, you know, it's always good when preparing food. Mm. You know, seasoning cube has its own way mm. of doing things. Mm -hmm. And if you start cooking with your seasoning cube, there is mm. a possibility that... You won't taste it. No, okay. that your food might got burnt earlier really? than it's supposed to be. Okay, so. that's a hack for you from T-Square. Mm. Do you know that? Did not know that. So are you, what would you advise that we do instead? How? I mean, when using our seasoning cubes. So it's better when you, when you are using your seasoning cube, it's mm. better for you when your food is about to get. Okay, um, when it's about yeah. to be ready, then so you add in your seasoning yeah. cubes. Okay, okay. Didn't know that. You see one of the reasons you should always tune into the show. There's so much to learn, guys. I hope you're watching right now is going to get a pen and paper and scribble down because there's so much to learn here in the kitchen this morning. And not just here in the kitchen, but also here on the show. Um, I assume we'll be ready in a bit, right? Yes. Now, talk us about what we're doing for the yam. Uh, as I've said, this mm. is basted yam. Mm. I'm going to baste it with... Very okay, so can we see how you do that quickly while, you know... <coughs> do you need me to help you with that? No. Okay, see. He's such a gentle man. He doesn't want me to touch anything. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so we're about to baste up our fries. I'm sure you could also do this with potatoes. Of course, yeah. Plantain. Uh -huh. mm. Okay. Nice. That looks good. Okay. Uh -huh. So much pepper here, we can't use all of it, so I'm just going to move it aside. Okay. That looks like suya spice, though. This is not suya spice. It looks like but it. But it looks like suya mm -hmm. spice. Okay. Okay. So this has everything that the yam needs to give it that taste. flavor and yes. taste. Yes. Fantastic. Are you also going to fry with onions when frying no, the yam? No, no. Okay. Okay. The onions is for us. Uh -huh. Okay. So I'm using it now. You know, I like to have used onions when frying my yam because I feel like it gives it that extra taste. Yeah, some people usually add uh, onions into their vegetable oil. Mm. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice. Welcome to the kitchen, Jeff Shagun Johnson wow, and Vicky B. Thanks for joining us. Thank All right, you. yes, this is ah, Chef T-Square. And this morning, he's made for you both yeah. basted fries with asu spice. Asu yes. spice. Yes. Mm. A lot of attention went into it. I so can find quickly. our cutlery for, for BKB. Oh. Tell us how to mm -hmm. put this together. Mm. Let's see. This is, uh, this is asu and uh, basted fries. Yeah. So, basted fries is the combination of T-square spice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And um, you can see that I coated it with the spice. Yes. So, I wish even you over there, you can come and taste and know the uh, how it right, tastes. Look how and this good is asu, peppered asu, you know. Mm. Wow. This is traditional way of All making right. asu. Okay. 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 So, so please eat and enjoy. All right. Amazing. So, okay. You need to get the glasses ready. Yeah. Because oh, from, get, yep. get the water ready because yeah. it's going to be very, very hot, spicy, please. But please no, it's not, hot. Okay. it's not hot. It's not hot? You sure? You sure? Yeah, it's not. No, 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 it's not right. hot. Okay, okay. okay. Right. Yeah. Right. Mm. 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 What do you think? Very nice. Ah, nice. Yes. Well done, nice. Well done. We've done you. everything we can to put you into the Friday groove. Absolutely. Friday mood. And uh, hopefully you're going to have mm. an amazing Jekyll, do you have anything weekend. tomorrow? Any Uwambe? Yeah, let's, let's follow you now. Oh, like... You said oh, any one day, day tomorrow. Any party. Of course, of course, as so, usual. Are we, can you invite? Invite. Let's get crushed. As a matter of fact, the father of the bride called me on my way here. Uh -huh. He said, "Shagun Joe, you bought tomorrow, won't no?" I said, "Ah, okay. yes, it's in court." He said, "Don't worry." Uh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> so, my sister, yeah, but then, want to go. but do you think it's? But have you guys thought about it? I, be, I want to believe that your industry has is beginning to look into it. So now that that's. Is no, you, I mean, you're not allowed to, consider, to yeah. spray monies anymore. Mm. What is the alternative for? I mean, for you guys to also make some monies. I mean, mm. okay. So we, we, I did an event. I did a performance mm. day before yesterday. So what they, what they did was they printed Owambe money. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. But they yeah. made sure they avoided the, the word Naira yes. or the Central Bank of Nigeria. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, so they did Owambe money. So when you get to the hall, mm. you do a transfer to the celebrants. Yeah. Celebrant gives you Owambe money, the equivalent okay. of the transfer. Okay. okay. 
So you come on stage yeah. and you spray the nice. the oh, one money. money, not not the. Naira. the Nah, yeah, but then you mm. like because they also spray you live band people too. And now don't want the money. You gotta receive this money. Spread me. Yeah. Yeah. Receive After the event, yeah. I gave it to the client, and, and she then. gave me the transfer. Oh, nice. Oh, yes. Nice. Yes. So nice. the voucher system might work. Exactly. Oh, well, the voucher yeah, that's what it is. The word. Nice. 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 Wow. <laughs> what a way to kickstart the weekend. We yeah. have absolutely enjoyed it all the way from Monday up until now. You yeah. guys are the crown, the cherry on the ice cream sundae. Thank yeah. you very much. Yes, you yes, are. They, they the week. Both of them. Oh, uh, yeah, uh, you too. Uh, everybody. Uh, everybody. Uh, everybody. Uh, including all the yeah, guests uh, from uh, over the week. Thanks for the performance. Yeah, to all our guests, thank you so much. Vicky B, you are phenomenal. Thank you so much. much. And that's a wrap for the week, people. Yes, so see you on Monday, 7 a.m., y'all. Bye. 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 <laughs>